Just do it. It's a slogan that community leaders could easily call their own. We like to get busy right away. When we see a problem, we want to make a difference. Just do it, anything. It's a great start. With all that enthusiasm, things do begin to happen. People get involved, projects get organized. Some are successful, while others, well, they need help. And maybe a lot of help. That's why I want to share with you some ideas for building upon enthusiasm. We can do better than just staying busy. We can get better results to accomplish, well, almost anything. Yogi Berra, a famous American baseball player, was known for his odd quotes. He once said, if you don't know where you're going, be careful, you might not get there. So, we're going to talk about planning and getting back to basics so that we know where we're going. Because just about everything works better with planning. Even something as simple as having lunch with a friend is best when we plan. What kind of food do we like? What cafe will we choose? When? What day? What time? Will we invite others? As we ask these kinds of questions, we're making a plan. Simply put, plan is what planning is what we do to get from here all the way over to there. That's it. Yet, I'm aware that so many community leaders, they feel overwhelmed when it comes to planning. Well, you know, I remember when I was learning, I would go to these conferences and the experts would talk in a mysterious jargon. They piled on so much complexity, I was confused. When they drew their planning models, it didn't help. They came in all shapes and sizes, round ones, square ones, pyramids, and even three-dimensional cubes. So many diagrams and charts, I got lost. No wonder many of us dread the idea of planning. Well, I want to make the case that planning doesn't have to be so complicated. Actually, for most of us, a simple plan is best. Why? because it's the one that we'll actually use. It's no good to make a plan and then put it up on a shelf and forget about it. It's got to work for us, right? Let's peel away some of the complexity, all of the complexity, and get back to basics. Planning begins with a few questions. How, what, when and where. That's all it takes. How is about strategy. How will we get from here to there? What method will we use? Will we walk, take a car, buy a bus ticket? We decide on how we're going to do it. That's what the strategy is all about. Then we ask what. What is where the action happens? It's the action that implements the strategy that we just decided upon. Here's where experts use the terminology of goals and objective tactics and action steps. It really doesn't matter what we call them. What's important is that we're able to detail specific actions, concrete and specific actions. Then finally, when and where. This grounds our plan in reality. When will we do it? A timeline. And where will we do it? Our community, our, our countryside, we decide where we're going to do it. 
Well, that's about, oh, wait a minute. Maybe it's a good idea to add two other ideas, two other questions, the who and the why. Who takes us to considering resources? Do we have the resources for the plan, the people, the skills, the finances? And why brings us back to remembering our, our, our origins and how we got involved in this work and what we actually want to accomplish? It keeps us focused on the important benefits at the end of our plan. So that's it. With a plan, I think we can accomplish almost anything. Of course, these ideas need to be adapted. They need to be adapted by you into your own leadership style. So here's a takeaway that can help you. Remember mind mapping? I put a link below if you need to review it. And take some time to review the link and think about your organization. Mind map it. Ask the planning questions. Let your mind flow. Record the answers as you branch out, one thought at a time. It's a great way to prepare for a grant writing task or, or asking for funding from anyone. So, what are you waiting for? Get started. Like Yogi Berra said, be careful. If you don't know where you're going, you might not get there. I'm Judd Dolphin, and this is Leadership for Social Change. Here's a place where you can get ideas to help you accomplish almost anything.